Good morning, good news, everybody. What is up, Ramley? What is up, Rams fans? So today's good news is, I guess, bad news for a former Ram, but now back home, is Michael Brockers is back with the LA Rams from what I'm seeing um, on Twitter. There's reports from Ian Rappaport that de defensive tackle Michael Brockers is heading back home after it falls apart in Baltimore. Brockers, um, I guess in the Ravens, when they were negotiating deals, he must have not liked, he decided did not agree to what the other side wanted. So that, that deal fell through. So then my, Brockers ends up going back to the Rams. Um, I'm not sure if it, whether right now it's a one-year deal or whether it's, you know, I guess they're going to have to go through deals as well. But <coughs> it, it gives the Rams better stability on the defensive line. And it was something I was kind of worried about because, you know, you got Sean Robinson from um, the Lions to come to the Rams because he was going to be the solid, you know, replacement for Michael Brockers. But what happens when Michael Brockers comes back? Well, that means Robinson might have to play nose tackle now. And he, he came in into the league, I think, as a nose tackle, defensive tackle type of guy. So that puts Michael Brock Brockers back to left end, right end, wherever end um, he plays. Uh, as a defensive uh, lineman and that puts uh, Aaron Donald in an even better position to make plays because now he won't be double team triple team with Sean Robinson so that actually helps out everything else because if you have a solid three defensive lineman in a three four defense then that allows your pass rushers to get after the quarterback better one-on-one -on -one blitzes um, that also allows, you know, if we can create more pressure with, with the edge rushers that you have, then that gives the secondary better time to, you know, make plays and, and deflect passes and get interceptions and, and just cover their guy even better. And if their receiver gets open, but the quarterback is being pressured, there's no way that that guy's going to get the ball anyway. So it, it's a good thing. I think the Rams did a really good job of um, making sure that they solidify that defensive line Having Michael Brockers back to the Rams really helps the Rams big time. So this is news that just came out this morning about two hours ago. So yeah, the Rams ended up with uh, Michael Brockers back on a three-year deal from what is being said. So he's getting basically the same deal he would have gotten with the uh, Baltimore Ravens. A three-year deal, a $31 million deal. Um, value similar to what Baltimore had on the table LA get LA gets more firepower up front on the D-line so that helps out the Rams tremendously I'm pretty happy about that this is um, basically I feel like this is like the Indonic and Sue Brockers and Aaron Donald um, combination which they had a really good job and they and, and that's when they had the most success when it is when they had the the most solid defensive line I think in the NFL I don't think Ashawn Robinson is to the par of a 2018 Sioux, but there's really high upside with Ashawn Robinson. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not saying he's like another Sioux, but I'm going to say he's a young guy in his prime. He was a you know early second round pick. He was really good. He went to the Pro Bowl, I think, once or twice. And then he's been pretty solid with the Detroit Lions, but he's never played with a guy on the defensive line like Aaron Donald or a guy like Michael Brockers or just a different team other than the Lions. And the Lions have their, their set of issues as well. So uh, having a team that can put up points and then if your defense is able to make stops in crucial moments, this team could be pretty nasty, man. This could be another 2018 Rams. Now they just have to go and solidify the rest of the the rest of the uh, the um, roster, the re the linebacker core, and and the secondary. I think it's just fine for right now. I think we have a solid secondary. It doesn't mean we can't go and maybe draft a player that you know that is, is ha has a high ceiling that you might have to develop. But uh, I think the secondary itself is pretty decent as of right now. But then you still have to go get pass rushers, which is still a question mark. And then obviously the linebacker position. So the defensive line is set. In my opinion, I don't see them going uh, for a defensive lineman. They basically solidify that defensive line for at least the next two years because AD is under mm -hmm. contract. Ashawn Robinson is with the Rams for two seasons, unless he sucks this year and they decide to cut him next year to save some money. And then um, 
we're basically good with uh, Michael Brockers coming back because he makes plays and he is that guy that that can really help out the run defense and he's he, he, he's he's a pretty solid pass rusher not the best but he's got he's a big body defensive tackle with a lot of uh, athleticism so uh, Brockers welcome home guy welcome home so you guys should be very very happy Brockers is back so let me know what you think leave a like leave a share leave a comment until next time you guys go Rams